Shut it down! Engine the police, shut it down! It's like a scene out of an action movie. Planes and military ships chasing down a speedboat off the coast of Colombia. But this is no movie, it's real footage of a high stakes chase. The speedboat reportedly carrying nearly four tons of cocaine worth $113 million. It's said to be the largest cocaine shipment seizure of the year along the Colombian Caribbean. The operation involved the combined efforts of the Colombian Navy, Air Force and Joint Interagency Task Force of the United States Southern Command. The Navy released video showing the speedboat's crew throwing packages overboard, then maneuvering erratically to shake authorities. The high speed chase went several miles with authorities eventually capturing the crew. Three Colombians, one Honduran and one Venezuelan were among those detained. The drugs, the boat and five suspects were then turned into the attorney general's office. Days before this chase, officials announced an American patrol aircraft and British warship pursued another speedboat. The crew reportedly threw drugs into the water near the U.S. Virgin Islands. Those smugglers were carrying three tons of cocaine and other drugs, according to UK officials. And last month, a joint search and rescue mission by the Colombian and Ecuadorian navies for two fishermen off of Colombia's coast led to a so-called narco sub loaded with more than four tons of cocaine with a cash value of more than $200 million. Colombia accounts for 70 to 80 percent of the world's cocaine supply, according to the DEA. And a U.N. report shows potential coca production in Colombia had risen 24 percent since 2021.